let the three components of the unit vector d be d1, d2, d3. Now since d is a unit vector, therefore the absolute value of vector d is equal to 1, which implies that d1 square plus d2 square plus d3 square is equal to 1. Let's call this condition 1. Now we are given that the dot product of vectors a and d is equal to 0. Therefore, vector i minus j dot d1i plus d2j plus d3k is equal to 0. This implies that d1 minus d2 is equal to 0, which implies that d1 is equal to d2. Let's call this result 2. Now we are given that the scalar triple product of B, C and D is equal to 0. To evaluate the scalar triple product, we start by evaluating the cross product of vectors B and C, which can be expressed in determinant form with the first row being i, j, k. The second row is the components of vector B, which are 0, 1 and minus 1. And the third row is the components of vector C, which are minus 1, 0, 1. This is equal to vector i times in brackets 1 minus 0 minus vector j times in brackets 0 minus 1 plus vector k times in brackets 0 plus 1. This simplifies to i plus j plus k. Therefore, the scalar triple product of vectors b, c and d which is equal to b cross c dot d is equal to i plus j plus k dot d1i plus d2j plus d3k which simplifies to d1 plus d2 plus d3 and this is equal to 0 because we are given that the scalar triple product of vectors b, c and d is equal to 0. Let's call this result 3. Now result 3 implies that d3 is equal to minus of d1 plus d2 Replacing d2 with d1 from result 2, we get d3 is equal to minus 2 times d1. Substituting these results in equation 1, which is d1 square plus d2 square plus d3 square is equal to 1, we get d1 square plus d1 square plus minus 2 d1 square is equal to 1. This implies that 6 times d1 square is equal to 1 or d1 is equal to plus minus 1 upon root 6. Now d2 is equal to d1, therefore d2 is also equal to plus minus 1 upon root 6. d3 is equal to minus 2 times d1 and is therefore equal to minus plus 2 upon root 6. Therefore vector d, which is equal to d1i plus d2j plus d3k, is equal to plus minus 1 upon root 6 times in brackets i plus j minus 2k which is the required answer.